Okay, class, we have two new students with us today. I want you to be nice to them. This is Maria. Maria, stand up so they know who you are. Hi. Hi, Maria. Okay, you can sit down. And the second student, come here. This is Josefina. Ew. What? You got earrings? What, are you spoiled or something? Um, no, I, uh... I've always had pure steels. What, were you born with them? You look like a train wreck. And is that hair real? Why are you being so mean to me? Maybe because you don't belong here? How come you will only be mean to me and not to Maria? Oh, that's nice. You want us to be mean to somebody good like Maria? Well, no, but I don't want you to be mean to me either. But too bad we don't always get what we want. Yeah, you're such a loser. Hello, you're the teacher. Aren't you going to do something? You're right. Thank you. You really do look like a tramp. What? Why are you being so mean to me? Well, I guess we'll never know, will we? What? Why is everyone being so mean? Shut up or we're going to come after you. But I didn't... That's it. Okay, I'm going, I'm going. Haha, <laughs> loser. a bad dream. How's Safina? You up? Yeah, I'm up, Mom. Okay, hurry up. You don't want to be late for your first day. Your sister's already downstairs. Okay, I'll be down in a minute. Hurry up. I hope things go good today. I don't want my nightmare to come true. Well, I guess I better get up. So are you nervous, honey? Nah. You know I love to meet new people. I'm gonna make so many friends. That's I'm glad that you're happy, honey. Yeah. I hear this school is a lot better than our old school. The food is better too. I can tell. How can you tell? You haven't been there. No, but I went on a tour and I took a peek at the school lunch menu. While you guys were talking to the guidance council office. Today we're having burritos. Can I buy my lunch? Of course, honey. But um since we don't have a lot of money, you can get your lunch for free. I did the pay book. You mean I get to eat school lunch and I don't have to pay for it? No, honey. Yay! Where's your sister? Uh, I don't know. I'm here. Well, it's about time, sleepyhead. Come on down. Come sit down and have your breakfast. You're going to be late for school. Yeah. What do I want that? What's wrong with you? Nothing. I'm just nervous about starting my new school. Oh, well, it'll be okay, honey. Here you go. Eat your eggs. I mean, I'm just the way you like, sunny side. Um, I'm not really hungry. You have to eat something, honey. You know you have low blood sugar. I know, Mom. Come on, eat. You don't want to faint on your first day of school. That's the least of my worries, Mom. Why? Nothing. What is wrong with you? Nothing's wrong, okay? I'm fine. I, I'm just... Are you nervous? No. Yeah, you are. How do you know? We go back eight years, Josefina. I know whether you're nervous or not. Yeah, you know everything, don't you? Just eat your breakfast, Josefina, before it gets caught, because we really got to get going. <sighs> I hear we're getting new students today. Yeah, I know. It's going to be so awesome. It is. Yeah, two new students in one classroom on the same day. That's pretty cool. Yeah, it is. Okay, class. Let's calm down. Get your books out. And um, as I said the other day, our new students are here today. So, I want you to be nice. This is Maria. Hi, everybody. Hi, Maria. Wow, she just seems kind of bubbly. Okay, why don't you have a seat, Maria, and we'll get to know you. Great! Is it just me, or is she really bubbly? She's really bubbly. It's not you. <laughs> oh, and this is Josefina. Come on in, Josefina. Don't be shy. Hi, Josefina. Hi. Hello. Okay, why don't you sit down next to your sister?
There you go. Okay. But since I introduced Maria first, Maria, why don't you tell them about yourself? Um, my name's Maria, and I like to sing and dance. I want to be a pop star when I go. Oh, whoa, whoa, slow down. There's no fire here. You're right. There isn't. It's too cold outside to be a fire. Oh, you're going to be one of those students, huh, with smart remarks? I'm just kidding around. I know. I was, too. Somehow you're not very funny. Okay, Maria, um, anything else you want to add? Uh, not really. Um, no, I can't think of anything. That's a first. You know, you're so bubbly that we thought you would have plenty more to say. I know, but I have all day to chat with you guys. Uh -huh. Wow. We are doing, after we do our work, you'll have done the chat. Okay, oh, Savina, what about you? What, what what about you do we need to know? Um, there's not much to tell. She has low blood sugar. <sighs> Maria, you don't have to say that in front of the class. Well, if she fainted or something... If she fainted or something, we'd have to know why. That's enough, Maria. Josefina, what else about you? Um, what are your hobbies? Um, I like to cook, and I like to play the guitar. I started taking lessons on the guitar. Oh, that's wonderful. Maybe someday you could play for us. I, I don't think so. How long have you been learning the guitar? Um, six months. Oh, you've got to play something for us one time. I'd rather not. Why? Yeah, why? She's really good. Except there's this one song she's doing that she can't get right. Maria. Maria, honey, why don't we let Josefina talk? Why? She's not talking, so I gotta do it for her. No, you don't. Okay, Josefina, what's your favorite food? Burritos. Oh, I love burritos. She makes good burritos, too. Oh, shut up, Maria. Isabel, you don't, I'm the teacher. You don't need to be the teacher. I'm sorry, but she's annoying. I'm sorry. Not you. I met Maria. Maria is really annoying. She's so bubbly, and she's just really annoying. You don't even know me yet. I don't need you guys. I'm too good for you guys anyway. All right, that's enough arguing. Josephine, if you have nothing more to say, then why don't we all get out our math books and, um, Josefina Marie, I'm going to have to do some tests um, with you. Josefina, you cook, so are you good at math? I'm really good at math. Yeah, yawn. Okay, Maria. <sighs> Look, um, all right, let's get our math books out. Okay, does everybody have their lunch? The cook is... The cook is about to leave for the fifth grade unit, so do all, you all have your lunch? Yeah, we have a lunch. Okay, great. You may talk, and I would use this time to get to know the new students. Okay. Hi, Maria. Hi, Josefina. I'm Julie. Hi. Ew, Julie, what's with the outfit? What do you mean? You're such... It looks so old-fashioned. It's vintage fashion. <laughs> Yawn! Hi, Josefina. Would you like to eat with me? Um, if you don't, it's okay, but I really would like it if you did. Okay, I'll eat with you. Great. Come on, let's go sit over here. What's up with your sister? I don't know. She's very outspoken. Yeah, I know. She's a jerk. You, you, you have to get to know her. That's all. And I know you're just being friends with me because you feel bad for me. What are you talking about? I'm not, I don't feel bad for you. I mean, no, that, that, that came out kind of wrong, but you know what I'm trying to say. Yeah, I know. I know, I appreciate that. It's just, um, you don't care that I have hyperglycemia? Of course I care, but that's not all I want to know about you. I mean, I can tell you're a nice person, but your sister is really mean. You gotta get to know her. Well, of course you would defend her. She's your sister. I know, but either way, 
Even so, even if she wasn't my sister, you just gotta get to know her. Can I sit with you? Uh, we kinda wanna sit alone. How's the thing? You can all that treatment okay? I'm new. You have to get to know me. We know enough about you. Shut up, Julia. I was talking to Josefina. No, don't tell me to shut up. Fine, I'm too good for you guys anyway. Huh. Okay, I take it back. My sister is acting mean today. Yeah, she is, and it makes me so mad. I know, but you gotta be patient with her. I mean, I'm used to it. We grew up together, you know. Yeah, I know. But she's so mean. Yeah, she is, but... She could be nice. She's just way too outspoken. She has a big mouth. Yeah, I know. So, um, do you want to come to my house tomorrow after school? Um, I'll have to ask my mom first, but I'm sure it'll be okay. Great. Friends? Friends. Come in. Hi. Hey, what are you doing? I was reading that. I need to talk to you. What does Julie have against me? Well, you were pretty mean to everybody today. I'm just trying to fit in. You can fit in without being mean. Yeah, I know. You are obviously fitting in. Nobody likes me. Well, maybe if you changed your attitude, people would. I think you know everything, don't you? I don't think I know everything, but you were way out of line today. I mean, you were really mean. And then saying you were too good for us, I mean, that was way out of line. That was so not necessary for you to say. I know. I just want to fit in. I don't want people to think I'm some kind of coward. Oh, we definitely don't think you're a coward. The girls at school don't like you. Gee, thanks for telling me that. What a good friend you are. I'm serious. You gotta change your attitude or you're not gonna make any friends. And you gotta stop being so shy or you're not gonna make friends. I already made one. Julie and I are friends. Yeah, she doesn't like me, does she? No offense, and I really mean no offense, but nobody in our class likes you because you're so mean to everybody and you're so rude. I know. I just wanted to make friends. You can make friends without being mean. I know. Will you explain to them about me? Well, I could try. I mean, even though you were being mean, I was defending you a lot. You were? Yeah. I'll tell you what, I'll talk to Julie tomorrow, and then maybe both of us can go to her house. I asked Mom, and she said it was okay. As long as I got a ride to her house and back, and her mom's going to pick me up. But I'll try to convince Julie to let you come. Then maybe... Maybe what? Then maybe people, when people get to know you, they'll like you. Yeah. Thanks. I'm gonna go do my homework. Okay. See you at dinner. Okay. I hope this works.